I should probably take care of this crime. Why do we do that? Hey, what's going on, guys? My name is Connor. Welcome back to the Dragon's Den, and welcome back to some more Spider-Man 2. We got a call from Aaron Davis, so we're gonna go see what's up with him here in just a second, or not. Yeah, that's gotta stop. Well, I was really planning do on. This with the mask on. I was planning on uh, doing the crime, but Dennis. I guess not. Relax. I'm not trying to get my ass kicked by my nephew again. What's up? Your dad used to give me that exact same look. Hmm. Kid? Someone got him out. I know what you're thinking, Miles. This is not on you. We can't let him live up here. It's just another kind of prison. It's not that easy. Never said it was. But sometimes you gotta push the past away so you can make room for the future. That's actually why I call. Need your help getting something. Could get it myself, but... Parole means Prowler's retired. What is it? Just some old tech I gotta get off the street. Stashed it by a decommissioned Roxxon lab near Central Park. Yeah, I know the one. Are you really putting Prowler behind you? Behind us. <laughs> Getting some? How did you? And hey, Miles, that Lee business? Don't be stupid. Yeah, please don't. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> I like the vibe of this game. I'm serious, Miles. This dude can turn your brain into scrambled eggs. Leave it alone. Now, what else is going on with you? How's school? College? Anyone you like? I don't know. So there is someone. Yes, there is. Okay. I'm here. What am I looking for? Just use your eyes, nephew. Uploaded some prowler code into your mask when I swiped it. Of course you did. The stash stays hidden until it detects the code from my suit. Hold L2 and scan for... Uh. Last step is to decrypt the key. Give it a shot. Don't cheat. Take your time. Oh. Done. Not bad, kid. I'm in a position where you can yank the panel. Oh, this panel. Pull it open from down here. There we go. You would have made a decent prowler. You should be seeing how to get inside now. Oh, I am inside now. What's this? Secret tunnel. Or not. Got it. You want to finally tell me what this is? 
Old suit prototypes. Feel free to keep it. Some good tech in there. Cool. Could definitely use this. Interesting. You received a rare tech part. Okay. You can boost your combat and traversal capabilities. Select health. Upgrade. Cool. So it's just all the... I don't like the suit that I have on Peter. We'll figure it out. Listen, this isn't the only stash. Dunk. Whoever freed Lee sounds like my tech is right up their alley. I want it falling into the wrong hands. You're the only person I trust with this. Okay, I got you. Coordinates are in the mask. Thanks, nephew. Don't be a stranger. I wonder what Ma's gonna say about this. Oh, yeah, Miles. Me enteré de lo que pasó con el transfer y con... ¿Estás bien? Sí, ma. Todo bien. Estaba ayudando a Uncle Aaron with some stuff. Ah. ¿Y cómo está él? Está tratando. Pues qué bueno. Mami, te veo en casa. And before you ask me again, estoy bien. Te lo juro. Te quiero. Let's head out to the city. See what's going on. Maybe... Actually, I'm actually gonna deal with this now. Um, I think I'm just gonna keep the advanced suit on Peter. Find Lee while I'm at it. Well, Miles, we literally just said not to do anything stupid, so you know. Tank or strength. with tire works? Bad idea. Didn't we? Like, so what's going on with those guys? I like how I'm just swimming right through the trees. Alright. Whoa! They're gonna blow up the whole block! <laughs> What's up? I'm stopping you today! I don't see you, Spider-Man! Come down and fight me! Only the unworthy get trapped in the web. <laughs> Stable until it's ready to unload. Basically. Okay. I'm all switch characters right now. All right. In my butt cool. every time. I can switch to him now. All right. Let's go see what Peter's up to. <clears throat> Hi, Pete. Your suit looks a little worse for wear. Chief Clark, everything okay? We're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but there's a lot of debris slowing down the technicians. If you're free, they could really use your webs to help keep the building stable while they work. Absolutely. Thanks. We'll keep working until you get here. Okay. I like how Peter's also in Harlem. All right, well, I guess while I'm waiting for the story uh, to progress. <clears throat> hey, Pete, you ready to come by the Foundation? Sure. I'm excited to see what you're up to. Great. I'm excited to show you. Oh, got to grab this call from NJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Just got off the phone with Harry, and this Foundation thing could be interesting. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the... Hold on. Sorry. NYC. The mecca of basketball. I'm sure you can play it anywhere with just a ball in the net. But when you 
got the people in the apartment buildings watching, the other players trash talking, and the sound of rubber hitting asphalt, there's a reason they call it the city game. Didn't know that they call hey, it the MJ, city. I'm back. So, this foundation thing with Harry could be interesting. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the tech that gang used to mess with the prison transfer. It's DARPA level stuff. Yeah, he was behind them as a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader. Some kind of big game hunter burp. So sorry, gotta put you on hold. That's enough fire for today! Bro, these guys are like. Like mass arsonists. You can't escape this. the fires before they could hurt anyone inside but that was close sorry MJ I keep interrupting Slinging our conversation stun, so anyway Miles thinks he saw their leader some kind of big game hunter fur vest looking guy interesting I'll keep digging if I can get this story on the front page it might help us track him down faster maybe save my job too yeah because that can only go overall all right, well, we're gonna. I'm gonna kind of take the scenic route. Oh, that's way too far. Oh. Either or. I feel like the web swinging is like so much more powerful in this game. I'm starting to get used to the web wings here a little bit. Hey, what's up? Just wanted to let you know that I talked to Gloria, and Beast is gonna send a donation truck to the house tomorrow for the rest of May stuff. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to go through everything by then. Could you cancel that? I promise I'll donate it all myself as soon as I'm finished with everything. I'll call him right now. But. Don't push yourself too hard, Parker. You still get I'm serious. Hey, you know I'd much rather be curled up next to you with the latest physics journal right now. <sighs> Especially that French one. Sometimes you're just too romantic. I'll talk to you later. What the fuck is this? Is this like a spider? Good, good. Well, well, well! Spider-Man's a shutterbug! Click, click! Whip, whip! Yeah. Some things in New York you just can't explain. Yeah. And that's what's great about it. Yes, it is. Oh boy. Alright, let's go deal with this here. Another tanker strike? Seriously? Hey! Need a dance partner? I've been waiting! Well, Miles is here too, perfect. Everything 
Nice. That was dope. Thanks for the assist. Just trying to keep up with you. Damn. Having two Spider-Man in this city definitely helps. Nuts. Just nuts. Alright, let's go deal with this here. Oh, Times Square. I don't think I've, I've rarely ever come through Times Square in the main game. Interesting. God, this this the map feels so much more alive. I love it. This is the Emily May Foundation. This is a really cool building. Wow. I was wondering what this place was. Emily Osborne May Parker. Tree and memory of May Parker. May blossoms in memory of May Parker. That's perfect. That's awesome. You made it. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker. Hello. So, what do you think? It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> and now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. I believe that Norman Osborne just wants to do good. He just has the wrong way of going about it. Uh, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh, really? But I was gonna give him a tour, let him Decide for himself. All right. <laughs> you know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. I firmly believe in this Norman Osborne that he wants to do well. This has the wrong way of going about it. So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place... Right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... He got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission. To heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is. Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Okay. This place could give, like, the Avengers a run Here, for their money. follow me. Check in on Dan and Annie. They're both doing great. Well, that is not cross-tabulate with the AI learning we did during the last milestone. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? Hell yeah. You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator. A carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Wanna see how? Sure. Probably has something to do with these drone-looking things. Yeah, bee drones. 
Whoa, this is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were trained to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA bee wolves. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not to. Those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. <laughs> nice, Harry. I've got nice so much more to show that. you, Pete. Let's go. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. It's Dr. Connors. <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Uh, any chance I can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness. Aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Okay. Well, that's weird. Your doctor <clears throat> is the lizard. Yeah, I believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call. But, uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. Do we get to face the lizard again? That's the question. Otto's arms. So that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. This would have been crime scene evidence. I wonder how it ended up here. Interesting. What? What to be this? Nice. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. <laughs> Other stuff over here. Should we call Miles since you know we have some downtime? What are we looking at here? What's this? Some kind of radiation treatment, maybe? Wonder if this is what they used for Harry's treatment. Potentially. Let's see what's going on here. Maybe I can help. Oh yeah, that would take a while. I'm not sure there's time to dig in now, but I'd sure like to come back and work on this later. So many cool things here! Yeah, it certainly is, Pete. Looks like Connors is putting the research he did after he lost his arm to good use. Wonder if he regrets testing that serum on himself. It must be unnerving walking around with dormant lizard DNA in your body. Has to be. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. 
I'll see you in a sec. There's one other thing. Please remember that on your left. Did you do the XR analysis? Oh. Peter's just running people over. Beehives show complex group decision making and group locomotion. Swarming is an annual process in which the colony expands and splits. The Emily May Foundation has discovered that specific changes in the honeycomb's vibrational spectra precede a primary swarm. This research will help beekeepers support healthy swarming without invasive observational techniques for optimal health and reproduction in our beleaguered bee population. Okay. Drones. Yeah, uh, doing a little cross collaboration between the energy lab and the agricultural lab. Ultra light drones using the new battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. All right, let's go upstairs. Did you see the monthly schedule update? I did. And what are we doing here? Hey. What are you doing with these bikes? We're working on ultra-efficient batteries, charged by bicycles. These bikes? Can I ride them? Not right now, but when they're road-ready, we'll need people to test them. Nice. I'll try to come back. Cool. Alright, let's go upstairs. Let's be up here. God, this is a really cool facility. I've always been interested in science, but not interested enough to like want to pursue it. All right, what do we got here? You really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but I'll have it back up in no time. Incredible. Really cool. Where are we heading now? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school. To middle school. Okay. Please. Now, do you know the... Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Rebora Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? No, I didn't. Oh, you have to. It's seriously one of my favorite spots in the whole building. It's so calming, and we're doing cool research inspired by the cellular structure of the koi fish's scales. I'll be sure to go check that out. We could have fed the fish, and I missed it. My fault. Disappointing. If you look at it that way. Got it. What are we looking at here? Doctor Foster. Thanks, Doctor Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Doctor Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Sure. Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. Ooh. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Grab X to Match grab the a base hex pairs to All right, I got it. growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Um, can I rotate? Interesting.
I'm bad at these puzzles. Let's see. There we go. So what, do we create a new plant? Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. I wonder if this goes there. Ah, there we go. Just knowing which piece it's put together, I guess. One step closer to feeding the world. Well, <laughs> nice so now we work. have to match attributes. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. No. Okay, if I combine these traits. Beautiful work, Peter. There we go. Sweet. Done deal. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow. I know a rooftop you could use for a real-world test, if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Okay. Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. Show Your office. office. Or is it our office? Harry, now remember. The things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet. Not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on. Where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Uh, where did I put it? Don't tell me you lost it. Nope. False alarm. Right here. <laughs> Go ahead. Swipe. Wow. It's just smack dab in the middle of everything. Hmm. Man. Harry. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. Uh, I think the Avengers would disagree with you, but you know. <laughs> Join me? God, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and Nate proud, huh? It's amazing. Peter, just say yes. There's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. 
<laughs> oh, one quick thing. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm gonna need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Yeah. But Coney Island later, yeah? You bet. This is cool. That is cool. Miles got making her phone go off, so we'll go see what he wants. Oh, hey, I forgot to tell you. Some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the locations, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. Literally. We have a new suit. Oh, It's the Amazing Spider-Man 2 suit. We are totally using this. Uh, we got some suit tech. Up our health. Okay. Skills. I should probably do some group skills here. We have a loop-de-loop. -loop. Cool. I should really upgrade Miles here. <laughs> Alright. This is a good looking suit. Hey, sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... It's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on! Don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me, your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. We'll do. <clears throat> you know, it's cool. You know, as cool as it is to have the amazing to have the amazing Spider-Man suit. We're gonna run with. Uh, I I can't like, I can't get over how good like the advanced suit looks. I I remember I used to hate the advanced suit, dude. <clears throat> but no, I love it. Oh, we got an EMF thing over here. What's... what is this? Hope Dr. Foster doesn't mind if Spider-Man... I don't think Dr. Foster would mind if Spider-Man helped Peter out. Jesus, this is Peter, insane tech. Peter, excited to have you on board. We've partnered with your friends at Feast to feed the community, starting by improving our gardens. To help, please collect some samples of nearby plants and put our gene splicer to use. Okay. Easy enough. Collect some samples, splice some genes, feed the people. I think I can improve on this. Let's look for the best samples. Should be something around here. This one's technically a weed, but the hardiness could be helpful. Oh, there's like actual multiple. All right, well, I was not expecting to do this. Let's scan these vines. This one's really productive. Lots of fruit. That's perfect. These are clearly more efficient with water. I can use that. Okay, got some great samples. Time to bring them together. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see what we can do here. The EMF is making these GMOs open source. Profit shouldn't be part of the equation when it comes to basic human necessities. No, it should not. Let's see. Aw, oh, fuck. Alright, um... Can't wait to see this grow. This over there for right now. Oh shit. Can 
Can I remove this piece? No. If this works, these plants will be growing faster and bearing more fruit than ever. Just imagine what Feast could do with all of that. There we go. That's what I needed. We're creating new plants. Okay, made some great new hybrid seeds for them. Just gotta get this place ready to plant the seeds. Let's optimize their water. Yikes, gotta patch this up. Oh boy, Spidey. Seems to be multiple leaks lowering the water pressure. If I don't find them all, the system won't work. to patch up. There we go. Would be counterproductive if I drowned all the plants. Oh, there's... Done? May used to have a green thumb with her tomato plants. See, I have green webs. Should do it. Dr. Foster will be pleased. He doesn't need to know Spider Man helped out. I wonder what other field projects the EMF is working on. No idea. Oh, we have a Sandman thing a over sand here. Sand crystal? These things are everywhere. Ah, guys, you're kind of getting sand everywhere. Should really leave and go somewhere more tropical. We done? We're done. There we go. Should probably check out it's that crystal then. To follow them. Figure out who they are. I end up at this abandoned school in Harlem. And I'm already beginning to regret this. Marco must have felt so alone during all this. His back against the wall. I can relate. Interesting. Poor Marco. Anywho. So we now have fast travel. We now have fast travel in Chinatown. What's up, Danicasters? I've seen the questions about that new Emily May Foundation. Who are they? What do they do? Well, big picture. It's an Oscorp spin-off, which we don't love, I know, but the man in charge, Harry Osborne, has got a decent rep. At the very least, he hired my favorite bee scientist, aka apiologist, Dr. M. Young. They're the foremost expert on colony collapse disorder and a pretty sick ukulele player if you happen to follow them on the socials. So, young Osborne, your foundation has a lot of work to do repairing your father's legacy, but so far, you're off to a good start. Don't forget to pay your rent on the first or, you know, withhold your checks in protest. Whatever, do you. Later. Okay, Danny. Don't see any bad guys. Maybe Miles and Genki had it wrong. Hey, I'm at the bridge. But there's no sign of our mysterious safari pirates. Ah, oh, man. We were sure it was there. Sorry about the wild goose chase. Don't sweat it. We'll find him. Not glittering? Come on, man. Oh. There's something there. Huh. Okay. What in the? Ah, 
Arachnid, come on! Now how'd your boss with the main get this kind of tech? A true hunter knows how to kill him. You could have just said I don't know. <laughs> I hate these bird things. Sit down. Oh shit. Well, nice knowing you. Should take a look around. I feel like this is probably important. This guy's struggling. This is a giant ass building. How do people not notice this? Here. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Maybe it'll lead me to some answers. Okay, birdie. Where are we going? Take me to your nest. I'm gonna miss these chases when I'm an Emily May. The adrenaline going through the city like it's an obstacle course never gets old. Getting to do real science, though, for actual money. Oh my God! I finally did it. I have a stable career. Okay, cool it, Parker. Daydream about those fat science stacks later. Time to chase. Why is this thing shooting at me? Insurance. I'm still doing the sand shit everywhere. Up, up, and you won't get away. Ah, there's another. One. No, 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 no. Nice cloaking tech. Mind if I take a look under the hood? Oh. I'll take that as a no. That's two cloaks now. I wonder if I can get my suit to identify their visual frequencies. I don't see your boss around. Where is he hiding? I want to talk to him about his lifestyle choices. Black Panther would be so useful. Dude. Now, where's your boss? Well, I think we're asking for too much here, Pete. Another robot. Maybe I can test something out. Okay. Let's see. Sorry, Birdie. This is just as awkward for me as it is for you. There should be a... Yep. Oh. Oh. Is that your home? Oh, Pete. Oh, come on, Birdie. Let go. Come on. Not buy a ticket for this ride. Oh, great. I have to deal with this. I'm gonna send this location to MJ. Maybe she can dig up some building records. Where are we going now? Somewhere over here. Hey, MJ. 
Did you get that location data I sent you? Yeah, it's an old food market. Owner died last year. Building sold a few weeks ago. Wait, this buyer. There's some shell company that's been acquiring property all over the city, like whole city blocks. I tried to do a story on them last month, but the trail dried up. Every person I was talking to just vanished. Go make yourselves useful. Our departure is imminent. Who are these people? No oh, idea. Yeah. Good luck. Need to take the... these two out nice and quiet. And the rest of the hunters? Their blinds are all set up and communications have been linked. We're ready. What a city to hunt in. Gotta drop one out of the way. Oh, the stealth part. I love the stealth part. That's one. Bang. That was fast. You find something? Two things. This armed group calls themselves hunters. And they've got a lot of accents. Hmm. International mercenaries? That's what I'm thinking. Could be front page material for your article. I'm writing it up now. Thanks. Oh, and speaking of work, I accepted Harry's offer. That's fantastic. Okay. We should Can celebrate we, like, later not... after you're done with your current work. Do this right now. Talk soon. Connections good. Generators are green. This base. Take five. Yeah, we've already been through one more. We don't need another. Let's teach me about all the different takedowns. Incident. I got put on, what do they call it? A leave of absence, so I torched their building. Nice. Hold up in my place afterwards and waited for him to come. <coughs> but it was Craven who did. Asked me if I wanted to hunt real game. And here I am. Ah, no fool. Sorry, I just interrupted your conversation. Where'd you go? There we go. You can join your friend. You can continue your conversation. That's everyone. Now, what were they up to? It's probably a... Uh... Hello. Surveillance video from the blind I was just at. Looks like they've got others. All around the city. Great. I'll send this to Genki. But he could help pinpoint these. What's Craven hunting? And why? Peter, do you really want to know the answer to that? Time to take my shiny new toy. 
deploy for a test drive. Surrounding bases are online. Remaining blind secured. Cloaking fields operational. Good. Beetles, Talon drones, ammunition, rations. I don't know what you're talking about, but I'm just gonna have you hang here if you don't mind. These guys are better equipped than most armies. This Craven guy must be rich. Or well connected. Or both. Name does not deserve to be spoken. I thought his youth would give him the advantage, and he had lived there all his life. Knew the trails perfectly. It makes sense, but his age is what did him in. He got impatient against the one man who does not. You think another hunter will challenge Craven here? Only if they are fooled. Ah! How'd that happen? Form on me! Oh, well, shoot. I was getting bored. All right, where to next? Looks like this is the only way. Which way? Oh, that way. Oh. oh. Okay. Oh, that stuff tastes awful. Not to self, don't do that again. A kitchen. A research lab. In the kitchen. Even studying Lee's blood. Maybe he's trying to figure out where his powers came from. Mm. Or how to get them for himself. Aunt May was so proud of her work at Beast. Lee broke bad in a big way. I just hope that doesn't mean everything he ever touched was corrupted. Yeah, that'd be nice. Oh, there's a the demon mask. An inner demon mask. Lee's old superpower gang. Craven better not be trying for the same with his hunters. Yeah, that'd be nice. <clears throat> what be this? Hallucinogens. Probably the worst part of Scorpion's poison. If Craven's adding this to his arsenal. Ugh. Craven's trying to become like the ultimate That's person. The Tiara Apitahi. One of the rarest flowers in the world. Its extract has some pretty powerful medicinal properties. I tried to get some years ago to counteract Scorpion's poison, but couldn't afford the flights to Riotea? Guess Craven could. We're learning a lot about this Craven guy. Dr. Farley Stillwell? His genetic experiments gave Scorpion his abilities. Craven sure does his research. Another one of these things? Were they testing their weapons on that armor? And not a single scratch? Meanwhile, the damage on Pete's suit is like starting to come Almost apart at the seams. Exact replica. Must have been probing it for weaknesses. Never be too careful with Scorpion. We 
a sec. <laughs> Secret tunnels. Would you look at that? God, I almost feel like we're in like another world here. Hey MJ, I have another name for you. Craven. Seems like he's the boss of these guys. And he's here on some kind of hunt. Craven the hunter. What's he hunting? Whatever it is, it definitely involves Scorpion and Lee. Oh, I'm going with this Craven guy in the meantime and letting Miles know what's up. Already on it. Stay safe. I hear you were not impressed by the Scorpion. Outside Savo, there was a man eater who killed close to a hundred workers. Craven was young in his prime, and he tracked the lion easily. Only took a few hours. Damn. But when he finally got close enough to draw his blade, Fuck. the lion was stronger. And, and it was only through luck that he managed to strike a killing blow. And the sensation. Find the killers who stink of death just as much as the man he did. A true hunter. <laughs> yeah. Okay, getting these guys out of the way is going to be not a fun time. There's one more person. Nicely done. Nice to sleep you. Look out, do you read? Someone check on the lookout radio. I've got no response. Checking my position. Could be above They're us. Gone. We've got an intruder. He's catching us in webs. Oh, these mothers are traveling in packs. Disappointing. very long.
could really use some answers instead of questions right now. You know what? I feel that. that. Looks promising. All right, Craven. What are you looking for? Wait. I get bringing Scorpion oh. and Lee on a hunt, but Black Cat's a thief. Uh oh, Peter. I don't. Right. There's Never this gonna thing win now. best in show with that attitude. <laughs> Why are there lion things? Nice. Doggy, kitty, robot. Come on, Pete. Oh, yeah, rot rot. Those teeth are no joke. Ow. Oh. Finally, I was wondering when animal control would show up. So you want to help that? Listen, this would go a lot easier for everyone if someone just filled me in. There we go. Jesus Christ. What were you protecting? Scorpion, Martin Lee, Black Cat. This Craven guy's putting together quite the team. Is it a team that he's putting together? There's our boy. Sandman. Is that part of a person? No, that is a person. All right. Scorpion. He's 
not teaming up with supervillains for some hunt. There is prey. Felicia. Oh, boy. Black hat. Where are you? Estás listo? For what? En serio? My date's almost here and you're surfing the web? Ma, no one says surfing the web anymore. <sighs> Can you just please get dressed? Okay, okay. I see you got your good lipstick on. <laughs> you must really like this guy, huh? Oh. Miles. I'm sorry. Look, next time, I promise. I, Miles. I love you. Well, son of a bitch. Don't look, mom. Don't look. Why are you snooping through his stuff? found a base belonging to those safari pirates or hunters as they call themselves and learned their boss's name craven and he killed scorpion and he's got a whole hit list of supervillains wait what does this mean lee don't know but this list is extensive these must be the people marco warned us about they were hunting sandman no way and felicia's on their list too black hat your ex? Exactly. She won't listen to me if I say she's in danger. But maybe she'd listen to someone she doesn't know. If MJ reached out to you with some addresses, would you be up for taking point on this? I got you. Thanks, really. I gotta clear my head for a bit, but call me if anything comes up and... We're going to find Lee, Miles. I promise. I like how Martin Lee becomes the focal point of this. I got some time until MJ calls. What's going on in the neighborhood? Sounds good. I'm going to leave it at that. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you guys leave it a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button for more content. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.